The race for Rhoda Mayor is heated. One Republican and four independents crowding the field. KUAM asked each of them why run for mayor and why now and what issues are top of mind. With my desire and passion to run and understanding what Rhoda needs right now, I feel I am the candidate to help lead our island. Falco, who has worked at the current mayor's office for seven years, is a former educator and is running under the Republican banner. Create an action plan that's going to help guide and be able to direct us and uh, allow our people to hold us accountable. This time, there are more independents than party members running for office. I see the opportunity to help out in that community with a lot of programs in mind that I see the need for us. Mesengan, another longtime educator, is also making her pitch to voters. We need to have a municipal, a solid municipal master plan for Rhoda. Also, we need to diversify our economy and improve our infrastructure. That was a view shared by each candidate, including Harry Masga. The people of Rhoda deserve a, an honest leader, a true leader, a clean leader, and a corrupt free administration. He's been a staffer for U.S. Delegate Kilili for the past 13 years on Rhoda. Everybody is talking about the um, medical apparel up in Saipan, as well as here, and... Uh, People wanted to have our own doctors and dentists since uh, five years ago. And sitting Senator Teresita Santos also wants to continue serving, but this time in a more locally rooted seat. My um, passion and commitment to continue to help our people has never wavered or ended. Her top issue is tourism on Rhoda. To create and diversify and sustain a vibrant economy. Uh, you know, we, we, we need to promote our island as a destination of choice by both international and domestic travelers. Alfred Tamanyao shares that goal but wants to see cost of traveling to the island drop drastically. It's part of why he returned home. Once I completed do it, did everything I needed to do, uh, I felt that I had to come back and give back to the island of Rhoda. He says the cost of living on Rhoda is also top of mind. The yeah, cost of living here in Rhoda is just so steep. Um, I know for the fact that there is ways that we can uh, uh, reduce or lower the cost of living here in Rhoda. And it's that cost to everyone that candidates for Rhoda mayor say is on the line this November. Tomas Manglonia for KUAM News.